everyone welcome back to city girl living on a budget my name is julia and this is an update video on where i've been the last two weeks so if you're new to my channel you would know that i was talking about so as part of the dave ramsey plan i decided that i have to continue to take vacations i cannot give up i cannot give up traveling that's just not who i am so i've been talking about how i am going to canada and now i'm in canada so the last two weeks i have been trying to wrap up stuff at work um, I'm a project manager, so I had to wrap stuff up, uh, transition what I could over, put on hold what I could what I could put on hold, um, you know, all that stuff. So um, that's pretty much been the bulk of my last two weeks, except for last Thursday. Last Thursday is when I actually left on vacation. It's now Tuesday. Wait, is it Tuesday? Yes, it's Tuesday. Um, so last Thursday, August 16th, is when I actually left on vacation. Um, and I'm staying, I'm staying in Airbnbs, and I don't have, well, I didn't tell them I have a YouTube channel, so I don't have permission to film in the house, so I'm filming in my car. And there are some guys sitting on like a, there's like a little porch with a table and some chairs, and they're sitting up there, and I don't know if they're watching me or not, and I'm too afraid to like turn around and look. So, anyway, um, so I'm in Canada. I crossed over on Thursday. Um, in Sault Ste. Marie, Michigan, and then I pretty much spent the last Thursday, Friday, and a, a little bit less on Saturday driving to Quebec City, so I'm in Quebec City now. Um, I didn't really do much yesterday, but I am on a tight budget, and so far I'm doing pretty good. Um, I have a budget of $600 per week, so $1,200 Canadian dollars, so $600 per week to include all gas, food, souvenirs, things like that. And so far, I got here last Thursday, and I've got, I did like a recount this morning of money I have, and I still have over $300 left. So I think I'm doing pretty good for this week. And then I've got my separate 600 for next week. So I think I'm doing pretty good so far. Um, I just, I wanted to get on here and kind of give you guys an update. The other thing that happened, um, so if you're, if you're new to my channel, then you also wouldn't know that I've been talking for a while. I haven't mentioned it in a while, but when I first kind of like restarted making videos earlier this year, I talked about wanting to be a mother and I was single. And I guess, I don't know if I am still single or not. We'll get into that in a minute. And I was single, like I wasn't dating anyone. Um, I mean, I guess I was dating, I was going on dates, I was on a dating app, but I wasn't meeting anyone, right? It was, nothing was happening. So I decided to just go ahead and be a single mom. Well, I met someone. So I went out, we started talking two weeks. So sun, this past Sunday was two weeks since we started talking. Last Wednesday was our first date and then Thursday I left for this two week vacation. Um, so I won't see him again until Labor Day weekend. Um, but yeah, I don't know. Like this just feels, this one feels different. So I don't know. I don't know. I have, if you've, if you've also been watching my channel, um, I have a friend, Frances, who is an esthetician and she does my eyebrows. She waxes my eyebrows for me and my legs. And she tells me stories of her clients who, cause she and I have always been in the same boat with dating, right? Like we would go on dates, we're on, we're on dating apps, we go on dates and there's always that, but, you know, like he's great, but what is that? So it's never like, it never works out. And um, she's always telling me that her clients, they just know. Like their their boyfriends, their long-term boyfriends or their husbands, like it's just, it happens immediately. Like they just know. And so the guy that I'm dating now that I went on a date with on Wednesday, last week, uh, we had gone to a restaurant and I arrived first. So I put our name on like the, the wait list and it was like a 30 minute wait. So he shows up and um, sits down on like that bench you know if you if you wait in the front of a restaurant they've got like a, they have like they might have seating area or like a bar so the bar was full but they had like this bench seat that was available so he sat down and then pulled me onto his lap so I'm like sitting on his knee and he told me that's when he knew we talked about it over the weekend he's like when you didn't hesitate to sit on my lap so that's when he knew I guess um so yeah, things have been, I don't want to say they're moving fast because we haven't gone on a second date yet, but we only haven't, we haven't gone that second date because I'm not around, right? I'm traveling. 
So, um, pretty sure if I was around, we would have been on that second date, but we've been talking every day. Um, so I don't want to get into too much now, like too many details now on him because I haven't told him about this channel yet. Uh, I don't know when I should. I haven't even told him about the Dave Ramsey plan yet. So obviously it'll probably happen sooner rather than later in this case, but we will see. So as of right now, I am traveling in Canada. I'm going to try to start posting regularly again now that I'm kind of settled. Um, and as of right now, single motherhood is being put off because I met a guy. And it's kind of fitting a storyline of what my friend Frances tells me about her clients. So, anyway, yeah, that's it for now. Uh, so thank you all for watching. I'll see you all in my next video. If you're new to my channel, you can find a channel trailer linked in the description box, as well as all the links to my social media. All right. Bye.